パパパパパパパパパフロックフロック What the fuck?I'm so sorry.I'm a child at heart, really. But we're gonna draw Flock. So, from Attack on Titan.、Uh, standard portrait of him. And close up on his face. I'm on a landscape orientation page. Use a pencil eraser and hit pause if I go too fast. Start with his eyes as usual. Center point of my page is about here. Come up over to the right. And we'll go for that top eyelid line. Right? So it goes diagonal at first and then it goes across. Like so. Okay? General shape. And then we just thicken it up. That and you can thicken this little bit up a little bit as well. Bottom eyelid, then down around. I'm just going to thicken this part like so. Iris, just a circle. Around in here. And the pupil in the middle. So we've got some extra lines, you know, in Attack on Titan, Mappa. Do some extra detail work around the eyes and stuff. Like so. We'll do the other eye. So you're about eye width. So measure this eye, right? That will fit in between his two eyes, roughly. Right? This here to here will fit in between here. Like, not like the frilly edges, just like the main part of his eye will go in between. Because we're in proportion in Attack on Titan. So you go, and then you go across again. And add some thickness, extra weight to the line.、Okay. This one. And bottom eyelid, so it starts here, curves this way, and then just goes across, like so. And then you can thicken this part up. Iris, circle. And pupil. Eyebrow then. So, well, yeah. <laughs>、um, so, yeah, here. Starting there. And then it like curves off this way. Kind of flat. And then. You want to like thicken it up just a little bit, add somewhere to add like brown color for his hair. It goes all thin back that way. We need the same thing over here. This way. And then just back like so. And then you just, it goes like real thin, like they use a real thin pen. To there. And then we have. There. There. Lines just around the eye, then. So, just at the corners. 
that maybe like a frown line or two and then his nose so just comes down on the left hand side of the middle of his face just there and then kind of sticks out and back in a little bit pointy there and then a nostril like so now in mappa attack on titan sort of style he has these vertical lines in here real thin you could use a ruler if you wanted it like makes their faces more dramatic or something Okay, so his mouth, simple sort of downturned, right? So it goes up, down, back up, and back down, right? So kind of like stretched out letter M or the handle of a bow and arrow. And then top lip line, bottom lip line. And then his chin. So proportions, eyes to the nostril, about the same as nostril to chin, say bottom of his nose or the nostril, here to here, about the same as here to here, maybe top eyelid, roughly his eye anyway, top of it, here to here, about the same as there to there, and then bottom of his nose to his bottom lip, about the same as bottom lip to chin, here to here, about the same as here to here, roughly, okay, the nostril really, that's what we're going for anyway. And then we'll go for his jaw. So we go up the side of his face. Up to there. And you're stopping kind of mouth level and underneath sort of the edge of his eye. Because that's where we change direction and go up the side of his face. Like so. Okay, it's a real strong jaw. Make this pupil a bit bigger. So his jaw, side of his face and stuff, it becomes his ear line, right? But we have sort of this hatching and stuff there. It becomes his sideburn. So we go like his sideburn here. And that's his ear then. Right, and this curves around. Like so. And bring this around to there. Lines inside again, so sticks out the little bump here, goes around. Like so. Okay, so he's got like a big fringe, right? So lots of hair spikes that come across his head. And there's no real trick to this, you just kind of add you see, start doing these curvy sort of spikes. So starting here. And you can kind of do as many as you want. It changes, the animators kind of change it every now and then. So, you know. Okay, just coming across this way. And 
me just keep that going. Right, and then so they kind of all bunch together here, right? So you've got some lines that go this way. Then we go all the way around his head. So which side doesn't really matter. We'll just go this way. Much higher up than you think now because he's he's got quite th thick hair. So, so if you're wondering like how high up you want your head to be, you know, the eyes are roughly halfway down the head. If there was no hair, you know, if there was a skull there. So here to here, about the same as here to here, and then hair on top. So like the skull would be like here. You know, so your eyes are roughly halfway down from that point. You know, between here and here. That's where you want your eyes to be. And then a little bit on top with the hair growing out from the skull. So then his neck curves down like so. And the collar of his shirt going this way. And it comes down kind of like a V sort of thing there. Got some neck anatomy. Like Adam's apple sort of thing. And again, tack on Titan, typical hatching lines. Like so. Uh, Right, so um, collar of his shirt, like this way, down like so, back in. So it curves around there, and then collar of the shirt. Same sort of thing again, like that. And then the shirt goes this way, and this one goes in behind that one. And then we have button area on there and then his shoulders right so roughly like your your face width will bring you out to the edge of his shoulder right so if you went so bumping like with his shirt so you want like face width edge of the shoulder about here this is where the shoulders start to like sort of bend down right so it'll go and then it'll go down right so the face width to there face width again so we just bump it because it is a shirt. So just check, go to here, and then we go diagonal, right? Roughly for his shoulders, and there could be like texture lines and foam lines and things. Coming down the shirt. And then just clean up any lines that you want and you're done. That's how to draw flock, flock from Attack on Titan. Hope it's helpful. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.